Greetings, I am Luis Bermudez. This presentation will provide the introduction of the work performed at the Cross Community Interoperability CCI threat as part of the OGC Web Services OWS8 activity occurred in 2011. The motivation and the scenario for a demonstration is based on an earthquake event. Location Monterey Bay, about 130 miles south of San Francisco on the west coast of the United States. A very important person, the president of Atlantis, was injured. And emergency responders in this scenario needs to work together to find the best plan of action, for example, evacuation. Each user has its own preferred view. Each one is familiar with an information model. They understand the semantics, the symbology associated with it, the attributes of the feature types. They often have tools that process the data based on that model. Can we mediate, convert, and style data coming from different information models into a user preferred model and provide better tools for emergency responders and the like? Can we improve sharing of symbology, conversion of conceptual information in UML to GML? The CCI thread investigated and advanced technologies to help in the previous mentioned scenario. In particular, it advanced semantic mediation approaches to deal with differences in heterogeneous data models, advanced the use of portrayal, style registries, and services focusing on the DigiWiki portrayal registry advanced the generation of KML, including interaction with portrayal registries, and advanced schema automation transforming UML to GML. Invisia, Carmenta, Galdus, Luciat, Composalt, Interactive Instruments, Esri, and Cubeworks composed a knowledgeable team with extensive expertise in the area. They put incredible effort, including in-kind contribution, we earn to them the success of the CCI threat. The main interactions and the leads of the components developed at CCI are shown in this architecture diagram. The components can be divided in three tiers. The client tier, composed of the clients, such as web portals provided by Composult and Esri, which the user interacts with to discover, get, visualize, and use the data. The business process tier, composed of a knowledge base with a SparkQL endpoint provided by Invisia, a CSW service registry provided by Composult, a semantic mediator provided by Luciat via WFS, an FPS and the DigiWIC portrayal registry provided by Carminta. And the access tier, composed of services that provide access to the data. This includes WFS interface to USDS TNM data by Cubeworks and WFS interface to the NGA LTDS data by Interactive Instruments. Following a service-oriented architecture design, all the components get registered to the catalog services for the web CSW Iberim service registry. Clients discover services via the service registry, discover the styles from the portrayal registry and interacts with the feature portrayal service FPS to get the portrayed data. Advancement of KML encoding was also advanced, in particular using symbology encoding rules from the portrayal registry to generate KML from WFS services. The feature portrayal service interacts directly with the WFS services, the original WFSs and the mediated ones to respond to the client's requests. The semantic mediation service provides two services. One is a WFS that wraps USGS data into the NGA model and the other one wraps the NGA data into the USGS model. It interacts with the knowledge base to get the mappings. A community that wants to participate needs to set up a WFS service and register a view of their model, for example, GML application schema, as an ontology, as well as the mappings to a common ontology in the knowledge base. 
This will allow the semantic mediator to get data from different communities via one model. The creation of an ontology can be cumbersome. Tools and techniques were advanced and implemented in shape change to make this process as easy as possible. The detailed work of the CCI thread has been summarized in three OGC engineering reports, as well as a change request to improve balloon style layouts in KML. The report and these videos are available at the OGC network. The next videos will provide more details on the client implementation, the portrayal, KML, semantic mediation, and the schema automation work. Thank you.